How to fix Apple TV remote app not working on iPhone. Reopen the remote app. Exit the remote app. Swipe down from the top right corner to open the control center. Locate the remote icon and tap on it to open again. Before moving to the next step, we would like to recommend Combo Cleaner. To keep your device running smoothly, avoid malware infections, and free up disk space, we recommend using Combo Cleaner. Available for Windows, Mac, Android, and iOS devices. Download and install it today at ComboCleaner.com. Grab our limited deal for Windows and Mac users. Use the coupon code PCRISK30 for 30% off at the checkout. Use the same Apple ID. The remote app requires the same Apple ID on both the iPhone and the TV to ensure that they are correctly connected and can communicate with each other. Restart the network connection. Swipe down from the top right corner to open a menu. Tap on the airplane icon to enable the feature. After a few seconds, disable it. Now, try to use the remote again. Re-enable Bluetooth. To open the control center, swipe from the top right corner. Tap on the Bluetooth icon to turn it off. Wait for a few seconds and enable the feature. Enable Home Sharing. To turn on Home Sharing on the Apple TV, go to the Settings app. Select Users and Accounts. Pick Home Sharing and enter your Apple ID credentials. To turn on Home Sharing on your iPhone, open Settings and go to Music. Scroll down and under Home Sharing, tap Sign In. Tap Sign In again. Reconnect the iPhone to the TV. In the Settings app on the Apple TV, select Remotes and Devices. Choose Remote App and Devices and select your iPhone. Pick Forget this device and confirm the action. Open the Remote App and tap Choose a TV on your iPhone. Tap your Apple TV and enter the four-digit confirmation code. Restart the iPhone and your Apple TV. To restart your iPhone, simultaneously press and hold the power and volume down buttons. Swipe on, slide to power off and then turn the iPhone on. To restart your Apple TV, tap and hold the menu and TV buttons for 5 seconds. After you see the TV LED flash, unplug it from the power source. After 30 seconds, plug it back and wait for the TV to boot. Then, go to Settings. Select System and choose Restart. Update Device Software. To update your iPhone, in the Settings app, Go to General. Tap Software Update. If an update is available, tap Update Now. To update your Apple TV, go to the settings on your TV. Select System and go to Software Updates. If an update is available, select Update Software. Reset Apple TV to Factory Settings. Open Settings on the Apple TV and go to System. Select Reset. Choose Reset again and confirm the action. To enhance security and recover device space on your iPhone, download the Combo Cleaner app. With the internet security feature, Combo Cleaner will protect your web browsing from scams, phishing, malicious downloads, and rogue websites. The password checker lets you see if your password is strong and not easily hackable. This feature will also check the online breaches database and advise if your password is safe. VPN is also included in the app, which encrypts traffic and hides your IP. Identity protection allows you to assess if your data has been exposed. You can check if your data was disclosed in a breach. SMS security filters SMS messages that contain malicious links, which can compromise your data. Photo Cleaner can help you quickly identify and remove similar photos and the ones with quality issues. The Secure Calendar feature scans links in calendar events and notifies you of the rogue ones, protecting your data from theft. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, subscribe to our channel.